Hello all of you. Um, today we have had a lot of rain and uh, the last couple of days we, we have had a lot of rain but it seems that all the birds are rather in, enjoying it and uh, there have been no problems with uh, chicks or youngs in the nest or with the eggs so I'm very happy with that because I have a lot of uh, birds on nest right now so I was a bit scared last night because uh, of very heavy rain. But uh, it seems like everything is, is going good, uh, so I'm going to, to give you a short update on uh, some of the youngs I've gotten this year already, and uh, some of the birds on nest and, and eggs uh, right now, so you can see what's going on. And up here, in the top of the aviary, we have the red crested cardinals who have built a nest very high above the ground, at least three and a half. Yeah, we have a small nest. And just over here we have another nest. And in here, in a very good sealed up place, away from the rain, the diamond fire tree has built a nest and uh, I can hear in the sound that when they're feeding there are lots of youngs in there but uh, I haven't been able to go and check. And here we have the long tailed things. They have had a nest of youngs who clipped the nest yesterday. I saw two youngs already uh, but hopefully I'll see more today. Here we have a very young female Boolean uh, in the midst of uh, getting all her colors. So, yeah, one of the youngs uh, from earlier this year, also outside. And up here again we have this thrush. She's laying on uh, five eggs. It's her, uh, I think, third attempt this year. But unfortunately, all the other attempts have uh, gone wrong, so uh, fingers crossed and hopefully we will succeed this time. And actually just below the nest of the thrushes, uh, there are a pair of uh, bearded ridlings have uh, built a nest in this box. Hopefully this will succeed. <laughs> now <laughs> the, the thrushes have begun to attack me. And here we have the red bishop young straight from the nest. I think uh, two days ago it fetched. And actually, this is the nest which the uh, long tail things have used. And right up here we have a nest. Completely of the design. And up here we have uh, the society finches. Very easy to breed, and they also have some youngs this year. And here we have one of the youngs of the bearded ridlings. Another Gouldy and Finch young. And down here, once again, the Red Cardinals are building the three eggs this time. New young I haven't seen before, and I can actually hear now that, that there are more in there.
and this is the female redhead pinch. They have come up with a litter of uh, five youngs. Very impressive. And uh, some of my newest addition, uh, some weavers, uh, much larger than the other ones I have, but who built uh, some very impressive and free hanging nests. It's a bit hard to see. The another pair of, uh, of diamond firetails have built a nest 